hey guys welcome back to my channel technology and today in this video tutorial i will show you guys how to fix a wired network is connected but no internet access in your windows 10 computer so you just need to follow me so at first you need to go to your start menu click on this settings button over there click on update security and from your left side you have to select troubleshoot option now under troubleshoot you will get additional troubleshooter so you have to click that option and now here you will get an option like internet connection so click on internet connection and click on run the troubleshooter after that it will detect your problem and it will fix uh, your problem after done close this window if still your problem is there then go to your search menu type over there cmd now press enter or click on this command prompt app and after open command prompt you have to put this command which is called ipconfig space slash flush dns after that press enter from your keyboard and after successfully flush the dns you have to restart your computer and it will fix your problem so after restart still if your problem is there then just go to your search menu Type over there ncpa.cpl and press enter from your keyboard and you will get this network connection window. Right click on your network adapter, go to properties. After that double click on IPv4 address and make sure that you have not put at any static IP over there if you are using a router in your home. If you are directly using uh, uh, your ISP internet connection to your computer then you have to check your uh, IP address properly. If it is uh, you know put it correctly then check your DNS address. So if you have already put it the DNS which is provided by your ISP then just go to your advanced tab click on DNS and click on add over there and you need to add this to DNS which is Google DNS. So 4.2.2.2 and 8.8.8.8 from here you can customize which one and after that click on ok ok and now try to check your internet connection it will fix your problem if it is not then just reset the tcp ip parameters then just go to your search menu type over there cmd now this time you have to run your command prompt as an administrator so right click on command prompt and click on run as administrator after that click on yes after open command prompt, you have to put some command over there which I'll provide on my video description. So the command is called net sh space win shock space reset. After that press enter. Okay. So you have to restart your computer after put this command. Okay. So after restart, still if your problem is there, just go to your search menu. Open cmd as an administrator again. And after open CMD, you have to put another command which is called net sh int ip reset. Now press enter. Now have to restart your computer once again. So lastly, I will suggest you to you know update your LAN driver. For that, you just need to right click on your start menu. Just right click and you will get this new window. Now you have to go to device manager. After after go to the device manager, you have to expand network adapter and find your proper network adapter and click on update driver and now click on search automatically for drivers okay so if you have so as you can see i have already using base driver for my device so it is already installed so just close this window and restart your computer and it will fix your problem so i hope this tutorial will really help for you and if you need more awesome content like this then don't forget to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon and also if you really like this video then don't forget to hit the like button it will really motivate me to make more videos like this so i will see you guys on the next time next video till then bye bye take care